Alright, we're here with episode number 22 of Let's Play Mass Effect 2. And one of the side quests we're working on is checking those terminals for clues to uh, the Observer for Liara. But before we finish that, we are going. Yay, that things will be alright. But yeah, our first order of business is going to be to access the taxi terminal and find Over this Justicar. A fish hey, restaurant for Krugan. I have never called you that. No, but you're thinking about it. You think it was easy growing up pure blood? I did some stupid things to get away from the taunts. The stupid drug users you're laughing at, I might have been one of them. Alrighty. I'm telling you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get it. Commercial spaceport. Here we go. Hopefully these taxis aren't too pricey. Oh, I guess they're robotically operated? That's kinda cool. Yay for the future. Flying over whatever the city's called. New something. Alright, um Why do these two have I guess because their loyalty mission's completed? That's probably why. Uh I forgot who we had with us. Was it these two, I think? Let's keep them a little while longer. Some Bolas and some Turians and an Asari. Where do you think you're going? Maybe that's her. <sighs> I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. <sighs> I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. <sighs> the victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. <sighs> what about Seems that like Justicar that just showed up? <sighs> Everyone I says she not. might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. So I'm thinking we have to solve a murder mystery to get the just car to come with us. Be an interesting change of pace. Alright. So let's see if we can find Samara. I wanted to be a Justicar when I was young. Every Asari does, I guess. Did you? This must be the crime scene. See here. Move along. Can I go through? Guess not. I like their um their tape here. That's kind of cool. Like hollow tape. Maybe this guy knows something. The cops don't admit it, but the Eclipse sisters run this area. Do they? Alright, nothing over there. No map in this area. Great. Alright, this guy probably knows something. What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off this world. Has Samara actually done anything yet? The Asari say that Justicars are lethal in a fight. And if they so much as smell corruption, they start shooting. The thing is, corruption isn't that hard to find around here. Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. Why do you think it was mercenaries? Dakni Kerr was cutting through a back alley last night when someone killed him with a shotgun. I saw his body this morning. They'd used modded rounds. That means Eclipse mercs. You must know something about these Eclipse. I occasionally do business with them. But only in well-lit places. With my guards. And only after the creds clear. 
This is a scummy bunch, even by Merc standards. They sell red sand, all kinds of illegal item, and they are all cold-blooded killers. Why would these Mercs kill him? And why do you think they're coming after you, too? I have no idea. We're innocent merchants. But they killed him, so they must be after me, too. I have to work the angles and get out of here. You don't seem too broken up about your partner's death. Dakni Kerr knew the risks when he took to spacing. Right now, my worry is me. It's unhealthy to be a Volus in the Nosaster spaceport right now. Especially a Volus named Pitney Four. Nosaster, that's the city name. I should go. Alright. Let's talk to the detective and see if we can get permission to go into the crime scene and meet our Justicar. I can choose your weapon over there. Nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need to recruit Samara for my mission. Then we'll be on our way. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. That's convenient. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're letting her into a sealed crime scene? I'm a cop. I'll work with the Justicar all I can. Besides, she's been looking at crime scenes longer than our two lifespans combined. She knows how to handle herself. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. But her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. I have no interest in dying, so if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Well, sounds like we're both getting something out of this then. Your superiors are sending you to certain death for no good reason. You have a right to disobey. Shepard knows impossible odds. Believe me. Most of the time I'm not being stupid about it. I can't say the same for Anaya's superiors. I'm a cop and I know my duty. I've been ordered to detain her and I will. Unless I can get her to leave my district first. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. I have to go. Good all luck. Right. Let's find Samara before the detective has to. So we already were at the crime scene. Um over here and now we should be able to get through shipping details area let's consider this extra stock surplus ship the rest to fax at his normal destination he'll never miss a few lost pieces alrighty is that a new quest maybe uh oh we're in combat suddenly seems like this alley is a dangerous place Save. Anything down here? Some credits. Get the rest of Bravo Squad prepped. Alpha Squad went after that just a car twenty minutes ago, and they've got some. Hey guys. You're Fighting collectors, these guys shouldn't be too bad. You're dead. You know what I need to do? I need to bind barrier, which is this one. We're gonna make this number one, and we're gonna make unity number six. <coughs> Alright, I think we're in the clear. There's some ammo. More red tape, or blue tape, I guess. Nothing up there. Looks 
looks like we found our Jessica. Those were my best troops. There she is. Tell me what I need to know, and I will be gone from here. Where did you send her? Very you shiny. Did I betray her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar. Somehow doubt that. What was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. Well, hello there. My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? That Merc was wounded and helpless. Do you just kill anyone who won't help you? If my cause is important enough, yes. Are you different? Mm. That's interesting, because when you put it like that, if your cause is important enough, I think we disagree about the levels of importance here, but uh, if the cause was actually important enough, like stopping the Reapers, I think there are a few things Shepard wouldn't do. I can't say that I... That is something we share. You are honest. That is another. How may I be of service to you? I need you to help me take down the Collectors. The Collectors are a worthy foe. I would relish testing myself against them. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. So it seems like I have one day to solve her mystery for her. Otherwise, she'll break out and probably kill the detective in the process. There must be some way we can all get what we need. I see a way. While I am in custody, you find the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Can you tell me more about Justicars? We are individuals who have forsworn family, children, and worldly possessions aside from some weapons and armor. We travel a sorry space righting wrongs as defined by the ancient code we have each memorized. Ilium may be dominated by Asari, but it isn't in a sorry space. My quarry fled to this place. I am sworn to hunt her down, and I will follow anywhere she goes. It is rare for a Justicar to leave a sorry space, but I must follow my oath. If I suffer for it, I will accept that. A moment ago you refused to give up your investigation, but now you'll swear to follow me? If I stay, I will be compelled to kill many innocents to escape incarceration. Like me. I may be killed, and my quarry would be free to continue murdering. If I come with you and survive your mission, I can resume my investigation. To do that, I need the ship's name to track her to her next hiding place. It is a simple choice. A slim chance is better than no chance. This Justicar code seems quite strict. It may seem so to you, but this is my oath. The expedient path may be fast and simple. That does not make it the right path. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well, I've got to get back to my station. And I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. Alrighty, so we've met our Justicar. Let's talk to Pitme. Is that him? There he is. Little guy. Hello again, Earth Clan. Did you speak to the detective? Why are the mercs after you? I know nothing about any mercenaries, Earth Clan. 
I'm merely an innocent merchant trying to make his way in life. The Eclipse are out for your blood. I need your help to break into their base. Shouldn't we work together? Yes. You're right, Earth Clan. I'm desperate. I've got angry mercs after me, and now this Asari Justicar. Let's talk. I smuggled a chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse. So they are perturbed and want to kill me. I see. Tell me about this chemical you brought in. It's called Minogen X3. And it's very, very, um, illegal. Anyone with biotic powers who is exposed to it becomes more powerful. The higher your exposure, the more powerful you get. But too much of it, you die. That's the part that the Eclipse found disagreeable. You've been in the Eclipse base. What do you remember? It's a series of docking bays where the Eclipse keep their private ships. They're well armed and they've got mechs. And they're all murderers. Every one of them kills someone as part of their initiation. I need to get into the Merc base. You're gonna help me. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. <laughs> Take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous. Are they all female, I wonder? All right. Guess we have to go this way now. Yay, an elevator. Probably about time I change Shepard's uniform too. When we get back to the ship at least. I see you. Subdue and suppress. A little worried about that door there. Alright, nothing to see here, I guess. Deploying warp fields! Toxic crowds will boost your price biotics, but a max dump meter will kill you. That's cool though. I wish I would have brought a more biotic heavy party. Oh, that guy used biotics, doesn't he? Um, he does. Actually, all three of these do to some degree. So I guess I picked fairly well. Alright. Mind over matter. Oh, that's Jacob, sorry. <laughs> There we go. Definitely notice those upgrades too. That way, interesting. Let's check out this way first. Okay, they did end. It's a cool mechanic, but it's hard to tell where the toxic play out. Oh, I see him. Okay.
Pachi's barrier there. I gotta, gotta get used to having that again. I right, seem to be in the clear. Ooh, a shotgun. Nice. A couple people can use that one. Um, we're okay with this, I think. Who's in here? Heard somebody praying. Who are you? Uh uh. Once I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. I'm not one of them. I'm new. I thought being Elnora the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. Lots of renegade choices. What do they do here that you don't like, Elnora? I thought we'd be flying around the galaxy shooting up bad guys and stuff, right? Shoot no. Bad guys. They just sell red sand and illegal you weapons. You are the bad guys. They even smuggled an Ardat Yakshi off world. What does Ardat Yakshi mean? It's an ancient Asari word for something that I thought was just a superstition until now. It means demon of the night winds. I didn't think they were real, but the boss said this scary lady was one. So, I'm guessing we'll have to fight one of those later on. What do they do here that you don't like, Elnora? I thought we'd be flying around the galaxy well, shooting up bad guys and stuff, but no. They just sell red sand and illegal weapons. What ship did they use for the smuggling? Wow, I have no idea. It was a few days ago, and like I said, I'm new. They didn't tell me anything. So I guess we have to find some kind of log. Get out of here, Elnora. If you so much as jaywalk, I will find you. Yes, sir. Okay, I'm going. Thank you. We're all sick just to car tomorrow on her. But she's not a fan of jaywalkers. Weapons ammo. Now what's this? There we go. Some biotic research. I can definitely use that. The enemy is somewhere. There we go. Oh. Excuse me. I like that Jacob's uh, upgrade thing affects my gun as well. I guess you can blow up these containers to make even more. Oops. Let's back up a second, let's get the ST drop. And let's send a boosted, uh. Oh, gotta get out, gotta get out. That was close, okay. Should we take the stairway or should we look in here? 
equips terminal. Um, okay, this one. And that one. And then... This one. Very interesting stuff here. I actually can't read a word of it. Um, Alright. So upstairs we go. Threat detected. Can you say that again? Nothing's gonna hurt me now. Ship's heavy. I'll tear you apart. Barrier up. Barrier is definitely less useful though when it shares a cooldown with other abilities. There's one of those clouds. Let's get out of here for a second. over that? I guess not. Probably have to go around then. Let's do it, Eclipse! So let's grab my other pistol. Take out that gunship. Probably get a little closer though. Actually, let's get a different weapon for now. Not that one. This one will do. <coughs> yep, I see him. Canisters, refined palladium, or platinum. Anything else over here before I move on? Closer. Anything up here though? This is a big area. I don't know where that gunship is. Alright, getting a 
little low on ammo, but not too much. There we go. Anything over here? I guess you can't go down there. Alright. I still don't know where that gunship went. I don't think I missed anything. Just some toxic canisters and fragile crates. Heavy weapon ammo. Data file. Well, it's official. Little baby Elnora is finally a full-fledged Eclipse Merc. I earned my uniform last night when I killed that ridiculous Bolas. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friends are going to be so jealous. So Laura was the killer. If we'd known, Detective Anaya would want to see this. Well, seems like I've been tricked. Time to take out some revenge. One thing I hate is people taking advantage of my kindness. Alright, we'll make her pay for that though. Sooner or later. We've been spotted. Please reconsider your aggressive attitude. How about you reconsider yours? We're in the clear. At least for now. More heavy weapons ammo? There's the gunship. And I don't really have any cover over here. Run! Run! Barrier! Alright, this crate is not going to hold very long though. Where's my, uh... There we go. Good against armor, but this cover's not gonna last very long. Yeah, I gotta get it. Debating between trying to get closer. All the cover around here is fragile, actually. Look ahead. Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna try to make it over here. Barrier. Give him all you got. It's going down. There we go. Good job, squad. Almost out of ammo with my heavy pistol, though. Alright, anything over here? Just a fragile crate. I guess that's about it. Some ammo. Alright, moving on. I hope we get to find Elnora or whatever her name is somewhere in this game. Got a bone to pick with her. Alright, down Y Link Bridge. Oops, I think I messed it up. There we go. Shipping manifest. This looks like a shipping manifest. That could be useful. It shows the Pitney Four sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of red sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves the Volus is a criminal. Detective and I should see this. We've got to keep moving. I forgot to say we're not done here yet. I was worried. Let's go, meant like let's go back to the place. 
to the uh, starport. Wait a minute. Who are you? Don't tell me you're the partner. That wouldn't make any sense. Interesting armor, though. I am a biotic god. <laughs> I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. What was biotics? There's a lot of powerful biotics in this game. There's uh, Jack, Samara, Sniper's not bad. Your main character if you make him an adept, but this guy is not one of them. You need help. You need help. Or you stand before the mightiest biotic ever. Mm hmm. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. <laughs> yeah, you sure that was your greatness? They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. But I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Are you part of Pitney Forest Trade Group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. <laughs> when I was mortal. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. Yeah, sorry. Don't think it's come up. I get the distinct impression Pitney prefers money to friends. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first... The leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. Good. I shall toss Wasaya about like a rag doll. He's in no condition to fight. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable. Yes, you can either do like the, the renegade thing and let him throw his life away against her, or you could uh make him find safety. Wasaya will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic rich blood will be the last step of my ascension to godhood. An ill wind blows upon Wasea, captain of the Eclipse Sisters. After me! <laughs> oh, jeez. Surprised I didn't get a chance to, uh, like, use a Paragon choice to stop him physically. Alright, you can choose your weapons if you want to, but I think I'm good with what I got. Whoops. Is clear. Didn't mean to hit that. Maybe now I'll have a choice. I'm guessing she's a pretty powerful Batic herself. <laughs> Close. Oh, watch out. Best drink. That's oh, probably some of that stuff. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off world. First a Justicar shows up. Now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass. Some of those <laughs> lots of toxic canisters there around. Take the heat off. <clears throat> oh, I missed her too. Head. What do I miss him? Oh, there we go. A, uh, nope. Barriers up. There we go. Ah. Lots of uh, classic clouds. Where's my armor pistol? Got ah. her armor exposed. Don't see anything above that cloud though. Cool if a singularity uh, 
like absorb cloud. Doesn't seem to work that way though. Nice music too. Where is everybody? Come out, come out, Captain. Stop throwing crates around like a little girl. Miss me. Where's my machine gun? Alright, she's got a bit of a choke point up there, so I don't really want to run through. Not sure if I have a time choice though. Let's get a barrier going. There she is. Oh, we're in the tux. No, we're not. She at least one of them, yep. There we go. Pretty sure we got her. Finish off her troops. She was holding that data pad in her hands. Uh, what did she do with this question? Down at her desk, maybe? There we go. Let's say his data pad. There's a Justicar here, probably looking for the one we sent off to the AML Demeter. On the AML Demeter. So there's the ship. I was happy to see her go. She chilled me to the bone. I just hope this Justicar doesn't mess up my operation. Gotta be the ship Samara wanted. Should we head back to the police station and give her the name? Or look around first? Uh, let's make sure we didn't miss we anything. we got time. Let's look around some more. Canister. We probably didn't miss much. But, oh, there is a terminal we can hack. Um, oh, I missed it. Is that the right one? I didn't think it was, but okay. Then that one, and then that one. Hey, I guess it was 31, okay. Got a little lucky there. Any upgrades over here, maybe? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Oh, do I have to go back the long way now? I guess there's no quick travel anymore. I don't know why my guns are out suddenly. The objective keeps moving. Alright, so let's see if there might be a uh, another quick way out of here. If not, I'll probably just end the episode, run back on my own, and start it once I get there. Oh, there we go. You can just click on the door. Back to the main yard at the spaceport? Yep. Let's go. That wasn't so bad. Alright. Lots of cleanup to take care of here. First of all, I think we need to arrest... the Valus. Who's this? I'm just some random Asari. There he is. Yeah, I guess I'll talk to you first. Thank you for removing the Eclipse Threat, Earth Clan. It will take them months to rebuild their organization. Also, merely out of curiosity, when you were poking about, did you perhaps run across a shipping manifest that belongs to me? You never know when something like this might come in handy. If it might change your mind, Earth Clan. Returning that manifest would be very profitable for you. If you Bribery. give it to the detective, her reward will be a pat on the back. Perhaps I should tell Jessica Samara that you tried to bribe me. I'm sure she'd love that. If 
if you have something that'll encourage the Jestakar to leave, show it to her. <laughs> She's just sitting here meditating. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. The Eclipse smuggled an Ardat Yakshi off-world. She's who you're really after, isn't she? You continue to impress. Yes, I was here tracking the Ardat Yakshi. She is a dangerous criminal, and I will bring her to justice. After your mission is complete, of course. You're sworn to follow a code that dictates your decisions. But I'm running a military operation. You wonder if I will refuse to follow orders because of my code? I can't allow that to happen. By agreeing to follow you, I am compelled to swear the most difficult of Justicar oaths, the third oath of subsumation. After I do, your orders will override the code. You should know, however, that I'll still give you my opinion if the situation warrants. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. Well, that's convenient. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. <laughs> I can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable heroes. Shall we return to your ship? Um, not quite yet. I need to speak to the detective. Thanks for getting Samara out of my district. I can tell my granddaughters about meeting a Justicar. <laughs> and you've just upped my chances of living long enough to have grandkids. I have proof that Eclipse killed the Volus merchant. Let's see what you got there. Interesting, but I can't verify it. It would be inadmissible. I vouch for Shepard and any evidence he brings forward. I accept the judgment of the Justicar. Thanks, Shepard. I wasn't sure about trusting a stranger and a human at that. But you came through. It's a shame Miss Elnora escaped. But I'll get her. Yeah, at least yeah. you put her on the run. Okay, enough with all the congratulations. Mine's still got a spiraling crime rate. I have proof that Pitney 4 smuggled in red sand and illegal weapons tech. I'll send in some officers to arrest him and his cohorts. This is a big help, Shepard. I can't do much to thank you, but we do have a small discretionary bounty fund. Take this. I'll be on my way. Be well. Value the Justicar. I've never heard of one working with a human before. All right. We have recruited Samara. Go us. We can still talk to her, though. I am ready to leave, if you are. Shall we return to your ship? I'd like to look around a bit first. Very well. Alright, I think we do still have a couple little quests to finish up on the LEM. Um, forming Mr. Thax about the stolen goods. Who's Mr. Thax? I just hear stuff. I don't really know who that is actually, but okay. Um, and Eter okay, I need to go back to Eternity, that club, to get the package. And then I need to do some things for, all right, we did that one. But there is uh, the Observer quest still. So I'm gonna end the episode here. And when we come back, we'll try to finish up our time on Ilium and maybe do a couple other things as well. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.